James Webb just found a gas linked to life in a place where life is impossible. On Earth, phosphine forms when organic material decays in swamps. It's a potential biosignature for anaerobic life. Scientists have been searching for it across the universe. But here's the problem. For decades, scientists predicted phosphine should exist in the atmospheres of gas giants and brown dwarfs. It should be common. It should be everywhere. Instead, it was nowhere. Every observation with the James Webb Space Telescope came up empty. No phosphine in exoplanets. No phosphine in brown dwarfs. The theoretical predictions were wrong. Until astronomers looked at Wolf 1130c, this ancient brown dwarf, 54 light years away in the constellation Cygnus, showed a strong infrared signal. Phosphine, about 100 parts per billion, exactly the amount predicted but it's the first and only place we've found it. Why here and not everywhere else? Scientists have two theories. First, Wolf 1130C is metal poor. There isn't enough oxygen to bind up the phosphorus, so it forms phosphine with the abundant hydrogen instead. Second, the brown dwarf orbits a white dwarf that may have produced phosphorus in Nova explosions thousands of years ago. Either way, this discovery published in Science in November 2025 changes everything. Understanding phosphine chemistry where we don't expect life is crucial if we hope to use this molecule to search for life on worlds beyond our solar system. The mystery gas just became our guide to finding life. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to like and subscribe for more mind-blowing science.